Good afternoon. I'm Mike Peterson with the latest from the KMA Newsroom on this Monday afternoon. As farmers head to the fields for harvest season, drought conditions still have a firm hold on the weather here in KMA land. The latest U.S. drought monitor for Iowa shows over 99.8% of the state is currently facing abnormally dry conditions. Uh, nearly 96.6% now have at least D1 or moderate drought, both of which are similar from earlier this month and worse than three years ago, or three months ago, rather. Iowa Agriculture Secretary Mike Nix says the worst drought conditions appear to be in northeast Iowa, where over 4.9% of the state is now listed in D4, or exceptional drought. Numerous factors, including growing concerns about a possible banking crisis in the country, are making for rough rural economic conditions. For the first time since March, the rural Main Street Index sank below growth neutral. Based on a survey of bank CEOs in a 10-state region, including Iowa, Nebraska, and Missouri, and Kansas, uh, September's index fell from 49.5 from August 50.0. Speaking on KMA's Morning Line program this morning, Creighton University economics professor Dr. Ernie Goss attributes the weak reading to several factors, including increased interest rates. Page County officials continue reviewing the proposed wind turbine regulations. Recently, the county's Board of Supervisors reviewed an initial draft ordinance compiled by County Attorney Carl Songson. The board spent several months earlier this year proposing changes to several sections of the county's 2019 ordinance governing commercial wind energy projects. And the results of this past Saturday's Shenfest Parade's marching band competition are in. Numerous middle school and high school bands competed in this year's parade. Preston Middle School, pictured here, placed first in the middle school division. And in the high school category, Fremont Mills placed first in Saturday's competition. You can view our video story on Saturday's Shinfest Parade online at kmaland.com. KMA on track weather. Sunday this afternoon, highs in the upper 70s, patchy fog overnight tonight. Otherwise, mostly clear lows in the mid-50s and patchy fog early tomorrow, then sunny with a high in the upper 70s. More news at 5.05 and 6.05 this evening and online at kmaland.com. Have a good rest of your Monday. Mike Peterson, so long, my friend.